previous video, we converted our castle vector shape into a symbol. And um, in this video, I want to show you how you can add symbols to your artwork. Now, I don't want this one where it is, um, so I'm going to delete it. Actually, just it's still selected, so I'm going to hit the, the delete key or the backspace key in the keyboard. And then I will go to the view menu and choose fit artboard in window. And if you just want to um, add a symbol and then decide where you want to place it afterwards, well, you go to your symbols panel, hover over the artwork that you wish to utilize and left click on it once. Illustrator then knows that's the symbol you wish to use. You can go down to the arrow at the bottom and it's called place symbol instance. When you left click, it adds it right in the middle of your image window, always in the middle of your image window. And then from there, if you then decide that you wish to move it somewhere, well, then you can just click and drag and you can move it somewhere else. So say down here near the, near the lake, the, the big patch of blue in there. And then I will click to the side of the artboard to deselect. The other technique would be to hover your cursor over whichever symbol it is you wish to use and then click and hold down the left mouse button, keep it held down and drag and drop another version wherever you need it. So if I just add another one just here, like so, there you go. Now those two pieces of artwork are from the same original. That's the source in the symbols panel. And if we were to edit the original symbol, then both of those two, what are called instances would update. So they're all linked together. A symbol of its same type, the same artwork, they're all linked together. So that's how you can add symbols. And we've got a couple more to add in here. So I'm gonna pick up my zoom tool, just click a couple of times to zoom in. And then uh, here we need to just switch back to our selection tool. I'm gonna to add a camping symbol. So I'm gonna click on that one and drag that down here just to show we've got a camping symbol. And then um, this thing here is the picnic area. So click and drag and add one of those just like so. And then we need to add a parking symbol as well. So click and drag and add the parking symbol down there just to fine tune that little bit position wise. And then another parking symbol just down here next to the castle. And with that, we're pretty much done. So that's how you can add symbols, one or as many as you need to, to your document from the symbols panel. In the next video, we'll take a look at how we can edit symbols.